Let's see, where are we going now? Mm, nah, I'm good. Uh, let's see, I don't know. I guess we can keep going in the... I guess we need crystals, right? Let's buy some more berry bush seeds. I'll buy these seeds, okay? Yeah, Helob, I know, right? Uh, thank you, Zare. Thank you so much for the tier three. Vampiric Dagger. Sure. If that parents something offensive, D and D is that case. It becomes satanic and, and uh, brainwashed. Yeah. I don't think people really take that seriously. At least not not nowadays. Video games and stuff are way more mainstream than they ever were before. Uh, I'm getting fucked up. Some people definitely take it seriously. Yeah, I mean, video games have been a boogeyman for a long time. Even whenever there's like a mass shooting or something, there's people who are, who like, they literally rush. They rush to blame video games, movies, music. It's crazy. It's, it's, that's just all, all to me, all of that is just straight up obfuscation and, and just not wanting to do anything. Oh yeah, they still do. And that's not just Republicans, that's Democrats as well. The Democrats do it as well too. Oh, hang on. Did I, uh, let me pay the people here. I didn't pay the bet. Your friend Ratao was the last vessel sent against us, the sniveling coward, and that were countless before him, all equally pathetic and unworthy. Nothing humbles quite like disease. Another plague? Again with the plague? God damn it, dude. Didn't you already do this last time? Caused another disease. I thought it was a disease. I thought he did disease last time. Maybe he didn't. And there goes your village. Who the hell is this guy? Clonko and Bop. Hello, wee lamb. Fancy seeing you somewhere dangerous like this. I'm Clonko and this is Bop. <laughs> what the fuck? We're off to our friend Ritalis for a night of drinking and dicing. It's going to be quite the party. Down there, there's no me for going overboard with the betting. Last time I bet, I lost my hand. Talk about overplaying your hand, haha. -ha. It was hilarious. I'll win it back, though. So you should come. You seem tough, rich, and fond of perfect for, uh, fond of risk. Perfect for knuckle bones. So they added a new guy just showed up at for knuckle bones, I guess. Interesting. The art style of this game is very adorable. Like the way everything is drawn. Really, really cute. Is this fun? This game is very fun, yes. Enemies have a chance to drop fish. Okay. Uh food, lumber, shop, question mark. Let's go food. We could probably use some more food. Yeah, I think uh, people forget that uh, cultures are not every culture is going to be in line with whatever the the West has decided is you know a moral like a lot of other countries. Yeah, and Disney will go out of its way to like edit some of that stuff down or whatever too. So that's definitely going to be part of it. I don't know, man. Sky, yeah, at the end of Rise of Skywalker, yeah. China too horny. There was actually um. I remember I, I was talking to my wife about this a while ago. It's like uh, almost like a, a, a glitch moment for some people. <laughs> it's like not everybody shares the same beliefs as you, you know? I think there's like, um, I don't know. A Muslim is Oh, I, well, no doubt about it, but uh, I don't know. I think m moral absolutism of any kind is just like doomed to fail. You know, like, 
or mo mostly doomed to fail. Hard to, uh, a lot of people have a lot of different beliefs and not everybody's going to be able to follow one creed or another. A gay kiss. Oh yeah, yeah. There was a, the gay kiss on Lightyear. Yeah, I heard about that too. Was he kicked? Was he kicked off the team? I didn't know about that. I didn't know about that. I only, I'm only like dimly aware. God, stop it. That guy finally dead? Moral progress is this right? I think I think the issue comes when you know not every country there are definitely people that have different values and different beliefs and you know looking down on other people and expecting them to catch up or something and to change their entire lifestyles is, is another thing so you know i don't know i'm inspired you to buy this game it's very fun whoa who the hell is this guy those things those kind of things, progress, progress is this, but those kinds of things don't happen overnight. And it takes time. It takes a lot of time. Gosh, 30% more damage at night. Well, it is nighttime, right? Idolatry is big to the blind and feel for devotion to something is dangerous. My point of view is that. Uh, hang on one second. One second. I'd like to not die. Ah. Mm. Isn't it daytime? I'm actually, I think it's nighttime. I can't tell actually. My point of view is that when it comes to morals and some kind of moral high ground, like sure the United States has, uh, there's a lot of good things about the United States, but uh, as far as I'm concerned in terms of our past and even our present, uh, we live in a glass house and we should not throw stones. You know what I mean? And that doesn't mean that, that doesn't mean that we're the worst the worst country in the world but uh we've done some fucked up things and we continue to do some fucked up things and not in the distant past not in the distant past we're talking about in living memory recently um uh do i want to change my weapon bane dagger hmm? we've done some fucked up shit man Heal the wielder using the life force of the slain foe. We're going to stick with my healing dagger, I think. And we're going to sell the bane dagger. Hmm? Let's ignore the bad parts. Right. Yeah. Well, I mean, you even see that nowadays, right? Where it's like... as a, I can't even imagine how horrific as a teacher. Like, let's say you're teaching high school history, right? Let's say you are a high school history teacher and this is not even this is not even this was literally this is literally who I was not even that long ago and you start teaching like slavery existed in the civil war like slavery and the spread of slavery to the western parts of the United States was the defining issue of the civil war like what a nightmare man I'm so glad I'm not, what a nightmare that you can't teach like uh, what's the point you know I'm gonna be K yeah right can you imagine yeah exactly my point is that i feel like nowadays you could actually like a parent could get mad at you and depending on your principal or where you are 
They'd be like, yeah, I don't teach that anymore. It's unbelievable. It's weird because it's just history and facts. Yeah, it's not even about like, it's not even about presenting some kind of weird moralistic argument. It's not even that. It's just like, this is what happened. This is the truth. It isn't about like, you know, but to them that that truth is prob that that path is problematic, you know? Getting a little low on health. Stop teaching my kids about history. Well, they want you to teach the right this. history. Do you watch The Handmaid's Tale? That's the shit I'm No, I haven't. Of. My wife's We're watched it, though. Real thick and fast. My wife has watched Handmaid's Tale. Uh, Sarah Blank, thanks to the 500 bits. Thank you very much. Diseased heart, 20% more damage during the day. Let's take the diseased heart. We could use some health, I think, right now. We're a little low on health. You know, like modern manifest destiny and shit, you know? That's their point of view, and that's the fucked up part. Without it, oh man. It's fucked, it's fucked up. In Germany, isn't it illegal to teach about World War II? Absolutely not. If you're in Germany, I think it's required. It's against the law. Yeah, like I, I'm pretty sure it was like required to go there. Yeah. Hey, Morim. Oh, uh, well, I got hit already. Uh, I think we're gonna die on this one. Wow. Okay, so this guy, like, the dagger was kind of bad here because I was right up close to it. Fuck. Are you, uh, wait, are you, a, you're a problem, aren't you? Pro sense. Oh, no. Pro. Wait, pro sense. Uh, you're supposed to be my cop and you're, oh, you're going to jail, motherfucker. You're supposed to be my fucking cop. Re-educate. My cop is, is speaking against the ish. What the fuck? Okay, so we can't do the ritual. I think it's time for a funeral. Time for a funeral. All right, Indo Cloud. Rest in peace, Indo Cloud. Chat loves the leaders so much they're willing to work to death. Where are all my followers? A lot of them are sick, and a lot of them have died. <laughs> let's do the brain. Let's try brainwashing, right? Let's try it. Why not? It's time to get brainwashed, everybody. Uh, Obi-Wan Jabroni, thank you for the 12 months here. I'm giving everybody mushrooms. <laughs> okay. They're all brainwashed. <laughs> all right, let's go build the hospital. I can heal people. Okay, so, okay, it costs camellias to heal them. Oh, I see. And then I can heal them, and then I can instantly heal them. All right, cool. Neat. Is he still sick? No, he's not. There's a... Uh, only a couple people are still sick. Oh, do I have enough crystals, by the way? Do I have enough here? <laughs> Praise the lamb. Those of you guys can become like, uh, I don't know what that's supposed to be. A new fish face, I guess. All right, we spent the crystals here. We improved the lighthouse. An ax is that what it is? An axolotl? Okay, cool. The lighthouse got a bit better. We can sit here and catch fish like all day. Do we need? He need he wanted a squid. Let's give him a squid. Here, take this. Caught it maybe 50 years ago. 
Carbine. This game gave you a nightmare last night about escaping a cult. <laughs> and I guess give him a lobster too. Okay, another piece of the amulet. Thoughts on the boys? Uh, I've seen season one and two. I haven't seen season three yet. Right now, we're... Um, you stocked up nice and good. If you Make find the fish and scarce, I'll sell them. Re-educate. Maybe it's better now. He's better. Release. And what do you got? Glorious leaders, some elders have been cast from their cult and now seek a place to enjoy their final years. Maybe we should let them join ours. Except. Except. Oh, wow. The farmers will now harvest. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. Let's do it. All right. Uh, he is uh, sick. We got a new follower. Hermarar. All right. Uh, choose form. We'll hit randomize for you. There you go. Uh, Sir hides a lot. Thank you for the 30 oh. months. Thank you, Sir hides a lot. Oh, old. Okay. You're old. All right. <laughs> okay. Prepare for ritual. Let me go dig a grave for you here too. Uh, we're running out of stuff to upgrade here. Let's see. Let's go afterlife. Unlocks the natural barrow. The corpses of dead followers may return to the earth by becoming fertilizer. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. The corpses of dead followers may return to the earth by becoming fertilizer. So we can turn the dead into fertilizer. Unlock the grave building. Gain two faith when followers grieve at the... Uh, the grave. We have plenty of fertilizer, so I guess we'll go with that. <laughs> we have plenty. We don't need more fertilizer. Uh, let's go back to this area. We haven't been back here in a while. Let's go here. You died for that? Yeah, sorry. Another bishop struck down Hecate ruled an eon, a feared by none. Her dominion being a famine, her peons now freed are ravenous. Tread warily, lest thou be predated upon. Hmm. So now the enemies here are stronger. Vampiric sword. And uh, ghost. Tearing ghosts out of the ground. Cool. It says it's uh, $50 to buy one of those followers. need more followers to do stuff but i don't feel like getting a shitload more followers really helps us much at the moment but i mean i'm by by no means am i some kind of fucking expert at this game um sure jquery thank you for the 26 months thank you jquery what's up dude saw dude Full health currently. I saw. Ow. <laughs> Is that like a California thing? I don't know where I saw, dude. I don't know where that first, where I first heard that. Is that like a California thing or something? I don't know where I first heard that. <laughs> Saw, dude. 
What was it Vine? Was that, I don't know. I don't know where. I know I first heard that like a million years ago. I don't know where it came from. It's a hella old meme. Mula. Uh, we can go get shit or we can go get food. Um, if we go this way, we can get a follower. I guess let's go towards the food. Pick pumpkins. Dude, after all the shit I've collected, I don't need, I don't need more shit. Vine was the goat. It was better than TikTok. I wasn't sure on this game's art design. Like, I wasn't sure about it. Wait. Oh, what? Where am I? Oh, shit. Finally, I've been looking forward to this. We're fighting the boss again? Fighting the boss. I didn't know we were fighting the boss again. <laughs> uh, okay. Shit. Yeah, we killed. So we killed this boss, but I guess we're fighting him again. in midair again <laughs> I killed him in midair again <laughs> oh man so I guess you can refight the boss at any time for a lot more money or something didn't uh didn't realize that we got 77 for that okay cool didn't realize you could boss refight boss I had no idea. You found my friend and then I beat him to death? Yeah, you did beat x Swiss to death. Yes, you did. <laughs> All right, here we go. Farmer Station 2. Oh, so this is you upgrade the existing farmer station to that. I got you. 
All right, we're gonna go send Nurster. Nurster, you're gonna go on a mission and you're gonna go get some coin. A ni it says 92% chance, a 92% chance. Go get me some gold, Nurster. All right, uh, let's go back to Anchor Deep. Uh, it appears you are having fun. Can you go back to playing that really, really miserable Ron Act? <laughs> Vampiric Hammer. Hell yeah, man, give it to me. Point of Corruption and Explosive Projectile. Go. Cool. Yeah, I'm good. I've already got, I've got Franker Face and Better Twitch. Uh, I like both Franker Face and Better Twitch for different reasons. I don't want another. I'm not getting another. It's not worth it. Whatever. Does 7 TV do anything aside from having more funny faces? Like, don't we have enough funny faces between, between those two? It has stupid big emotes, wide anime. Yeah, I'm sorry. That's not worth it. I'm good. Yeah, we'll take 20% more damage. Ain't worth it. Uh, smash with the hammer. Yeah, man, this weapon's sick. You're good with one emo. Twitch TV is the truth social social of Twitch. Seven TV. Any of the three can just enable the stuff from the other two. Yeah, one's enough for me. Ow. Now, if it had some additional fun, like one of the one of the major reasons for getting Franker face or, or better Twitch is the additional functionality of like uh, there, there's lots of extra things you can do with them. It's like that's really cool. It like literally makes Twitch like a better experience, you know. That I'm all for. Funny faces are almost like a bonus, you know. Not on mobile, yeah, sure. I mean, I, I would love to have Franker face on mobile volume yeah yeah there's a lot of features and stuff does barb still work uh yeah barb's been a, barb's a franker face emote so we can go left for a card you know i really don't think we need another follower at the moment let's go here there is better twitch on mobile on mobile i how do, i don't never had that When hit down to one half, all enemies will be dealt 10 damage. Weird. Huh. Interesting. 10 damage. I think I would rather have the critical hit because how often am I going to be at half health? Like, yeah, that's good, but I think I'd rather have the other. It's a cool looking card. Yeah. Okay, so this Shrine of Devotion, it allows you to refight the boss, but all, you can only, at any time you can do that, it'll take you back it's, to the boss, but not until you beat the boss. You gotta beat the boss for that to actually take effect. I'm, I, I, I finally understand the purpose of those. <laughs> There's an app for mobile called Chats. I don't know, never heard of it. Uh, Goontech, thanks for the 23 months. Dr. TP, thank you for the 500 bits. Thank you very much. A new decoration, cool. I like that there's different resources depending on where you go. That's really cool. Nuggets. 
You have subscriptions for no ads, not really for the emotes. I have subscriptions because if I enjoy somebody's stream, I'm like, all right, here's some money. <laughs> Even if it's only like once in a while. I, I'm subscribed to some streamers who like I, I hardly ever really watch, but uh, I don't know. I'm probably like extra fond of streamers considering I myself am a streamer. So I'm like, all right, we get money. I can afford it. I like streamers. They entertain me. I mean, really like $5 a month is like a joke in the, in the grand scheme of things. Like it, I'll tell you what, it adds sell. up. If you're subscribed to a lot of streamers like I am, it definitely adds up. But I always talk myself into it because it's like, it's like $5. Sure, I'll give you $5. It does add up though, if you're subscribed to a lot of people though, then it really adds up. You're like, wait, how much am I spending a month? <laughs> For some. I thought it was a third of a meal. Subscribe to 840 Twitch channels. Yeah, that would be a lot of Twitch channels. <laughs> I don't know. I think at my most, I think I've been subscribed to like Maybe like 40 chan channels or something. It's it's a lot. I've tried to cut down and then it... I try to cut down and then it goes right back up. So. Get 10 at some point. I don't think I don't think I did that. I, I'm pretty sure I do not di deduct uh, Twitch subscriptions. I'm pretty sure I don't do that. <laughs> Necromantic Gauntlet or Touch of the Revenant. I guess we'll take Touch of the Revenant. You know, actually, I think I'm going to keep the corruption because I like the bombs. Yeah, we'll recycle that. Yeah, that's a lot. I mean, I, I like it. I like I said, definitely adds up, but uh, I, I talk myself into it because I like supporting my friends and fellow like a lot of the streamers that I'm subscribed to are like literally my my friends. Like I, I know them and they are my friends on Twitch. Like I've known them for years. Why not draw? Wait, did, did I not take I thought I I think I already took a card, guys. Did I not? Oh, I thought I already took one. <laughs> Whoops. Attack rate increase. Receive double the health when healing. Ooh. Yeah, sure. Double the health. What's friends? I've made a lot of friends on Twitch. I know you hear about parasocial relations and stuff, but I've legit... Uh, I have more friends that I've met from Twitch than I have left over from, from like real life high school and college and stuff. My, my Twitch friendships I have replaced like my actual, my like real life friends that I knew, you know? Like Pooh, Tofu, Laser, Smoke, like you name it. Like these are my friends. So these are people I like Dan the VP, you know? You can agree with that? Yeah, I mean, and, and, and you know, it can be hard when you're just naming you never meet people, but honestly, you know, I, I meet people at GDQs and stuff and there'll be other stuff for sure. Pandemic changed the dynamic. Yeah, for sure, right? Are we your friends? You can be for a tier for the price of one of one subscription. <laughs> you can be my friend for the low, low cost of four nine nine a month. I could show a new friend. Hang on. Uh, some healing would be nice. Uh, Noodle Spoon, thank you for the 30 months. Noodle Spoon, I'm going to hit you with a DM. I'll give you my private phone number. And you can call me anytime, brother. Call me anytime. Vinny Velvet, thank you for the tier 3 10 months. I will give you my, uh, my OnlyFans. I'm going to send you my link to my OnlyFans here in just a minute. Not actually, don't actually have an OnlyFans. It's only a joke. Not a real thing. 
Uh, Vinny Velvet, thank you for the tier three, man. I really appreciate that. Not a real thing. Yeah, that explosive thing is really good. Can you help me move? Bro. My my wife, <laughs> my Katie was helping her parents move recently. And I told Katie, like, listen, somebody asked me to move at this point in my life. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna tell that person, listen, I'll hire a mover for you. <laughs> Can I send them in? I'm gonna send a mover in my place. Like, I'm not doing that. Traders Razor, Eker Throne. Yeah, sure, let's try this one. Why not? Based. Power move, yeah. You know what? You, I, I, I'll hire that person and I'll pay them extra. Like, while you're there, they're going to call you Chris. Just, just go with it. Your name is Chris for the day. <laughs> We're just going to go in my place. So does Eker like do something? Bonus points if they dress up like you. Yeah, here, here, here's some clothes. You're gonna have to wear this too. <laughs> wear this Making Mario sure. costume. <laughs> oh shit, you killed me last time. keep fighting this boss i have the slowest fucking weapon in the game i literally have like the slowest weapon in the game every time versus this boss <laughs> more missionary stuff sure why not we'll upgrade our missionary uh in prison anybody else want to go to prison yeah, we'll, we need to get some lumber yards and quarries and stuff going for sure. Might of the devout, curse of this, zealous weapons. What is zealous weapons? Sure, let's grab that. If I join your cult, can I get free lifetime chicken nuggies? Uh, I wish I could offer such a thing. Uh, I don't think Nurster's come back yet. I don't think he's back yet. Uh, we can declare a new doctrine. Okay. Cults are built on lies. So we're actually maxed out except for possession. It's the only thing we can do left, right? What hap I wonder what happens after this point. When a new building is constructed to gain faith, all cult members will gain the devotee trait. Gain more faith when delivering a sermon. I don't think we really build stuff very much. Let's go devotee. Let's go with that. We don't build stuff all that often. Okay. Can we do a ritual to raise everybody's faith? Uh, let's have a funeral for somebody. Colt gave two chicken nuggie options: free to eat nuggies or free nuggies for the rest of your life. All right, let's have a let's have a we'll have a funeral for Hannah. She showed up and we instantly murdered her. <laughs> With your viewer account, I'm sure you get sponsored by your favorite fast food chicken nugget franchise at some point. I don't think that's how it works for Nisus. I don't think that's how sponsorships work. Remember Hannah? Yeah. She came in and we instantly killed her. Good times. <laughs> Good times. <laughs> okay. Go add in this, add in some fertilizer. Kind of seems like, uh, 
kind of seems like uh, my my place is becoming more and more self-sufficient. Like they're able to do everything on their own. All right, what do you want? I want to be the loyalty enforcer. Let me prove that I'm the right person for the job. Sure, accept. Uh, so I don't know if I failed that quest instantly because of a glitch or because I can't. I don't, I don't know why that happened actually. Yeah, I'm not sure exactly why. It's a glitch. So there's a glitch in the game where you instantly fail your uh, loyalty things, it, uh, your quests. It sucks. Uh, let's go, uh, let's see, we can do fight pit. Oh, let's do the holy day. Let's do that. Gain 80 faith. Yeah, sure, we should do that. You guys can have a day of rest. So when shit's really bad, you can do have a day of rest and make everybody happy. We'll do that. Okay, everybody happy. Oh, everybody got pissed off because I woke them all at night. <laughs> it's funny. All right, let's go back to that mission. Uh, did Oh, is he back? Is he going to live or die? I returned from my successful missionary uh, bearing gifts. He found 33 coins. Hey, good job, nurse sir. Welcome back. And now go to sleep. All right, let's go back and let's see if we can uh, actually finish. This mission keeps uh, keeps killing me. Let's see if we can actually do it. Should have killed them to pay the believers. Zealous Axe. Cool. Yeah, this one's an axe. It's a little bit faster, a little bit faster, still not great. Zealous weapons are great. I guess the zealous weapons give you more uh, magic. Full health. Yeah, they don't have that crazy wind up. Devotion, ma it converts magic to devotion. Oh, is that what it does? So whatever magic, you're the leader after all. Gold flooring. So whatever I pick up is gonna become devotion when I get back or something, is that it? Let's go back to the left here. I'm trying to remember insults from Hook. I haven't seen Hook in a long time, such a long time. It was really fun this past Sunday, we watched uh, Constantine. Oh my god, I have not seen Constantine since in so long. Holy crap. Let's get the double healing. I don't even remember the last time I had I'd seen Constantine. Yeah, Constantine's a good movie. It's, it's pretty good. John Constantine. We wa you watch that movie annually? It's a good movie. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, question mark. I guess let's go this way, I guess. We get something free here. 
Two kids I had, one true love. How can one say no to a god? You can't, I couldn't pick up that health. I was a huge fan of the college when that came out. It took a long time for me to acknowledge that it's a good film in its own right. Oh, was, was it like, oh, it's so inaccurate. I hate it. Is that it? I can buy Ambrosia. I choose the big gift. You know what? Let's buy Ambrosia too. Why not? Increases my attack power. Sure. Oh, we unlocked it. Oh, I see. The character is very different. I wonder, do you think they're ever going to bring Constantine to the MCU? You think they're ever going to do that? That'd be fucking weird. <laughs> oh, wow. You think they will? If they do, I hope it's Keanu. Oh, is he DC? Oh, he's DC. Okay, yeah, he's probably not going to make it over, is he? <laughs> yeah, that seems pretty rare. Uh, pretty, pretty, uh, pretty uh, unlikely to happen. Dumbass. I thought he was Marvel. Fuck off. Dumbass. I knew he was a comic book character. I didn't know he was DC instead of MC. <laughs> Wow, what a fucking dumbass. I like sit here and like talk about history, have an extensive knowledge about history. I confuse one superhero for being DC or Marvel and somebody in chat's like, fucking dumbass, what an idiot. You suck, you <laughs> jackass. <laughs> Yo, this guy's so fucking dumb. Do you believe that? He thought he thought Constantine was Marvel, Lemao. <laughs> never ch Twitch chat. I legitimately hope you never change. Never change, Twitch chat. Hope <laughs> somebody got fired for that one. Fuck you, fuck you. Same to you. Uh, Tar Aloran, thank you so much for the 28 months. Thank you, Tar Aloran. Damn, Barb, you right. Tears open and releases this. Death's Attendant, a melee attack that also summons ghosts from slain enemies. Sure, let's try this one. Now let's recycle the cleansing fire and let's go back. There are definitely rooms that are significantly uh, easier than others. Yeah. I guess I'll take this one. Did you know the opposite of a Debbie Downer is a uh, Beth amphetamine? <laughs> that is the dumbest thing I've read today. Congratulations. You are the winner. You win. <laughs> Literally the dumbest thing I've ever read. An elephant. Okay, so I keep dying to this this thing coming up. Nice to uh, not die to this anymore.
it's over here. meter in the upper left that's uh my magic meter and that's how many shots of magic i can do so like that was one of my magic you can see that the amount went down Magic missiles. Yeah, a bit like Hollow Knight, I guess. Definitely some Hollow Knight inspiration on this game, for sure. Oh, this is the boss. Shit, man. attack that keeps getting me right there. really really like to not get a slow weapon to go to this boss i keep getting hammer axe like it'd be really nice to not get a slow weapon for this boss <laughs> it's so it's so slow man i just want a not slow weapon <sighs> re-educate i keep getting it man keeps happening all right uh release rough oh uh, hang on is there god i wish there was something i could do to make it like why is everybody so unhappy with me mr kerrigan was asking for a sacrifice yeah i guess we could do that he says to kill him at night though right all right we got a new follower here chat finally i shit it there you go Accept. Welcome aboard. Okay, hopefully uh, we need to celebrate. Let us build decorations in your honor. Please don't fail it. Okay, so if you get the instant fail glitch on the quest, you got to, uh, you just got to reset and it, it fixes it. Thank God, because that was, that's like a really, that's a really shitty glitch. Okay, collect the reward from Pro Sense. Complete quest. Do I need more potties? Oh, we could probably make another potty somewhere. Probably wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, you lose faith when you die. Yeah, you do. We have a lot of mushrooms. Fuck it, let's do it. All right, everybody. Everybody get shrooms. <laughs> Eat shrooms, guys. You're resurrected from the dead and they lose faith? Apparently, yeah. <laughs> if anything, wouldn't that, like, solidify it? We could send somebody out on another missionary trip. Let's see. Who are we sending? All right, pro sense. Go get me some gold. 
Actually, you know what? Go get me some meat. You have a 94. So you have, it says you have a 94% chance of survival. We could, uh, we could get this guy. You know what? We're going to buy this guy. You're free. All right, chat. We got another. Uh, uh, you know what? I guess Zatrakek. You know what? Let's be fair to Zatrakek here, right? Except. Welcome aboard. I'm really hearing this music in my fucking head. <laughs> Once they scroll away, they're invalid. Eat a meal for an extra heart. Oh, look! Another hammer! <laughs> God. Can I please, for the love of God, man? Another hammer. Son of a bitch. I'm never going to beat this boss. Uh, overall weapon damage increased. More damage. Sure. Give me even more. What's my magic anyway? Oh, this is uh, invincibility, I think. The invincibility one's pretty handy. It's pretty good. This whole area is teal. What does that mean? The color? What about it? Queerly Aquamarine, Athena's aid. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. So I think against the boss, I think the game's trying to incentivize you for staying away and hitting the things at the thing. I think that's what the game's kind of incentivizing you to do there. Yeah, slow, patient, hit the hit the things at the guy. That does really bad damage. Well, it's just safe though, it's safer. Increase movement speed. Okay, we're now moving faster. Oh, uh, what is that? I don't think we've ever seen that before. What is that? Bones? Maybe that gets you bones? Let's go that way. We don't we really don't need bones. We've got a billion bones. These challenges are always like with nary a scratch. Uh, okay. Yeah, alright. These are fine. These challenges are kind of a joke because you just get like a little bit of extra money. I don't really want a follower. I feel like a new weapon could be good. I think that's a new weapon. Maybe we want a new weapon. That actually could be pretty nice. Acquired Stonehenge? <laughs> uh, okay, sure. We now have Stonehenge. Did you guys ever see the guy in uh, England? For a while, you know, when it comes to everything, like uh, the pyramids or Stonehenge and shit, people are always like, oh man, humans could never have done that. Oh man, there's no way humans could do that. It had to be aliens, right? Did you guys see the guy who like, uh, oh, am I dropping frames? Oh, there's a guy dropped some frames. Did you guys see the guy who like went out of his way to remake Stonehenge like by hand using all the class, like using all the materials? That shit was really cool. Like he basically made Stonehenge to prove that it was actually people who did that. It just felt like it. It's not aliens. 
It's all like leverage and and like physics and stuff. Yeah, yeah, guy just like he just went out of his way and like made his own Stonehenge pretty much. <laughs> oh sure, yeah. Frames were seized by the British Empire. Really cool they figure how to do that back then the pyramids were another one where it's like we we literally just don't know how they did it i think he he used like he didn't use anything crazy uh i, the, I don't have i don't have the video it's been a long time he did a did he do all of it by himself make it so actually no the pyramids were not built by slaves there might have been some slave labor but no they were mostly built by that's a common myth uh about the pyramids not actually built by slaves At least I don't think uh, that hasn't been a popular his that hasn't been a popular theory among historians like F for uh, an extremely long time anyway. It was aliens, not Earth. My mom's big into all that alien stuff. I'm like, oh, aliens did it. It must have been aliens. Aliens. I'd come home with my master's degree in history and be like, no, mom, it actually wasn't. It, it was actually wasn't slaves. It wasn't aliens. Like, here's actually how it was built and why it was built. It's really fascinating. She'd be like, uh-huh. Yeah, it was aliens. It's like, all right. <laughs> uh, knock back and poison enemies. Chance to heal the wielder using the life force of a slain foe. Let's go take this axe. Yeah, we're going to take this axe. We could use the healing, too. Slaves didn't row on warships. My mind was poisoned by that. So I'm pretty sure my mom's exact that. She said those exact words. I'm pretty sure to me. <laughs> okay, we'll take some, some poison damage. Pretty sure my mom said those exact words to me. <laughs> Okay, we got to be careful when we actually walk into the boss here, too. Hmm. Could have made the axe faster, though. You never heard they weren't slaves. Yeah, it's uh, it's not a lot of people think that the, uh, the, the, the pyramids were built by slaves. Like, nobody really thinks that anymore. I think the common theory is that the Old Testament was, um, like the Old Testament is the source for that. And I think there's like essentially nothing to support that at all from Egyptian sources or anything like that. Like there's, there's no reason to believe that. Weren't the, uh, isn't there like, there's something else too. Isn't it like at that time, the Hebrews weren't even supposed to be in Egypt or something. There's, there's some other reason, like the timelines don't mix up. I, it's been so long, I can't remember, but it's like they weren't even there. You never knew that was just a theory. It's a huge debate. It's like it's it's like completely off. It's not even close. We're gonna get no healing this entire time. I forget. There's um, I'm pretty sure you can you can probably look into this on uh, Wikipedia. You can probably get the um, like the debate about the pyramids, like construction of the pyramids. You can probably find a lot of information about it on Wikipedia if you wanted to read more about it. Um, I'm only I'm only kind of paraphrasing half remembered. Ancient aliens. Yeah, Wikipedia will tell you everything you need to know. Okay, I think this is the boss. Let's wait. I think that's the boss. Plus 
plus a heart, receive double healing. Uh, let's just take the heart. Yes, this game. Imagine a roguelite plus an Animal Crossing style. Like, they, those two games were combined into one, like, weird combination. That's kind of what this game is. You gotta manage your town, you gotta manage your followers, upgrade your cults. Those two things combined. It's really, really fun. It's a really, really fun game. Solid recommend. I think this is a, for me, I'd say it's a contender for game of the year. Uh, it's super fun. Uh, I think it's a contender for game of the year along with like Elden Ring, uh, Turtles, the Turtles game. Basically you're a Twitch streamer, Ninja Turtles. Yeah, really good. It's really fun. The time just disappears when you play it. him hit him with poison move away don't get hit by his shit i got hit by his shit Yeah, it's a, you know, it's when you find a game and your time just melts away, that's a special game. That doesn't happen very often for me. Like the last time I played a game where I felt like my time just vanished away, I would say would be like Elden Ring. Like my time, I felt like an Elden Ring, my time just vanished. And that was, that was, that was amazing. So, oh yeah, Subnautica was another game like that for sure. Definitely. Uh, yeah, when you start the game off, uh, you, you choose difficulty. I chose the absolute hardest difficulty. So I'm on uh, extra hard. There's a normal and an easy mode. There's uh, easy, normal, hard, extreme, hard. I'm on extreme hard. I'm glad I did because uh, I like the challenge level is good. I like the level of challenge. Uh, I would actually say it's maybe slightly too easy slightly too easy for me i would like it to be a little bit harder but i'm not going to complain about that like that's still it's a, it's a ton of fun all right let's see what are we building here cult four yeah sure let's go get cult four let's do it yeah for me i i'd prefer more difficulty more challenge yeah, absolutely. All right, let's see. All my brainwashed followers. So is it, are we, oh wow, we can get up to 175 now? Wow, okay, that's a lot. All right, let's go find out if he's gonna die or not. <laughs> I did it, leader. I retrieved. I managed to find 24 meats. Hey, thanks for the meats. Good job, Pro Sense. All right, you've earned a nap. Oh, hang on. Go to sleep. All right, we got a new follower chat. Who's it gonna be? All right, you're done. Welcome aboard. Looks like broccoli. Oh, we got an old person. Gabriel, it's time for a sacrifice. Come here, Gabriel. Hang on. Uh, you know what? Maybe we should wait. Ah, fuck it. Ritual. Time for the sacrifice. Sacrifice a follower. We got an old person here. <laughs> Where is the old person? Who's the old person? 79? It's not Alex. 
Does anybody know who the old person was? Does it show them? Me? Who was the old person? White robe? Oh, it's Gabriel. Bits. That's who it is. So Gabriel's old. The white... All right, here we go. Uh, Le Pew, thank you for the 100 bits. <laughs> uh, all right, let's see. What do we unlock? Increase the total amount of fervor. Sure. I don't really think this is a kid's game. I don't think so. It's Logan's now. That's kind of fucked up. Oh, we also, by the way, we also got the meat and bones from him too. So we can, I could make you guys eat that. <laughs> I could also feed you guys that. kind of game my mom regretted getting for me. <laughs> yeah, you can also do that. Alright. Oh, we also... Oh, they also pay me. I get money, too. And uh, let's go send somebody on a mission. Hammerwolf has not leveled up. Hammerwolf is brainwashed. Uh, Alright. Farting Spaniard. You're hired. Uh, we're gonna send you out to go get lumber. We're gonna send you out for lumber. Oh, we got a free old person? Maybe I keep this one, I grow hungry. It's a free old person though. Ah, we just did the ritual. We just did the ritual, we don't need it. <laughs> we just did one. Free old people equals a free sacrifice. All right, let's see what do we got. Tempest Gauntlet. Uh, I'm not sure if I like this weapon. I don't know if I like this one. We'll try it out. Skulls for the skull throne. Make it so. I'm not sure on this one. Uh, Dan G, thank you for the 65 months. Thank you, thank you, Dan G. Appreciate it. How's it going, man? Blood for the blood gun. Mm, that enemy didn't even do anything. Okay. I'm glad to hear it, man. The third hit is a lot of damage. It's true. Okay, this weapon's not bad. This weapon's pretty good. It's probably the fastest weapon I've had for a hot minute anyway. Whoa, check that out. That's new. That's so cool. I like it. Neato. Make Dan G the next sacrifice? Uh, I'll think about it. That's so cool. More moolah? <laughs> How many hours in am I? Uh, well, we just started playing yesterday. Overall weapon damage increased, a better chance for better chess. Uh, we'll go for weapon damage. We'll go with that. Is this a thwomp? Yeah, it's kind of a thwomp. 15 hours. Uh, I don't know. I did play a lot yesterday and I played a lot today for sure. I guess let's go to the question mark and then to the sword, I guess. 
32 hours. That'd be impressive. Who the hell is this? Peace be with you, Crusader. I seek only the truth and the light, but I may be service to you. I can increase the loyalty of any follower you choose. Hmm. Let's see, you know, Nurster is not loyal enough. My work is done. This fool would follow you into the deepest darkness from whence no one returns. Okay. Thanks, man. That was nice. You ba if you press R3. Is that true? <laughs> Did not know that. The day I learned. Speak to us, prophet. Hmm. I think we should maybe play something different tonight. What do you guys think of tonight? We played Mario Party just the other day. Who the fuck is this? Plimbo. Want a close look at the fine antiquities in the lands of the old faith? Golf, FPL, more lamb, Mario Kart. Hot Wheels. As long as me ships afloat and plimbos open for business. Ba -ba Hot Wheels. Age of Empires 2. Battlefield. Seems like a lot of you guys want Battlefield, huh? Banjo 3. It doesn't exist, asshole. Ah, come down to me sanctuary. Plenty of goods. Oh, we unlocked a new area on the map? Oh, that's so cool. We need some Friday Night Battlefield. It's been a little while. Not everyone's a good break from this. I'm thinking uh, tomorrow we're going back into the morsel ROM pack. Really <laughs> oh! Seems you cannot be stopped by disease or hunger, and he sends you back from death stronger each time. Please know it was not my idea to cast out the red crown. The other bishop's my sibling. The blame lies with them. Please, I beg you, spare me. Kill Shimura, but do not send me to my death. Do not send me to him. You will not find my temple. I'll be safe here. Yes, I'll be safe. So this person is cowardly as fuck, huh? Cowardly. Let's see, you get a lot of chores done tomorrow. Yeah, I'm really excited. I thought we were ditching soul crushing ROM hacks. I mean, it's a pretty interesting hack. It's an interesting hack. You know, I think it's worth finishing. It's had its moments of extreme frustration, obviously, but I think it's worth finishing. I finished worse hacks for sure. Deal poison. Okay. Is there a crit timing on spell cast? Is that a thing? I thought you just held it and it did the maximum attack. Swing with intent. Vampiric gauntlet. Chance to heal using the life force of a slain foe. Or eaker. Uh, so I guess I'll take this because this is going to be better than this. Because this is, this is weak at first. It's really hard to hit enemies with the third hit. So I did not know that. COVID is running rampant through camp. Yeah, I mean, COVID never, COVID never went anywhere. It's still there, right? The people who thought, I don't know who thought, well, it's gone. Thank goodness that's over. It never really went anywhere, dude. The lingering presence of Calamar can be felt. Yeah, I know it's camp. Red hearts have been converted into blue hearts. Is that a good thing? I don't know if that's good or not. <laughs> Is that good? <laughs> Oh, they meant in the game. Oh wait, uh, are you talking about the disease spreading in my in my camp? Is what you mean? I 
I did not know you could do a fucking critical hit. I didn't know that's how that worked. I thought you just charged it up. That's so cool. Oh man, I did not know that. That's awesome. I didn't know that was a thing. So you can apparently time the cast to do a critical hit. I never knew that. <laughs> I, I thought you just held it up, charged it up to max, and then that was it. Wow, fire a projectile when you swing your weapons. Let's take the hearts. We could actually use some health here. I think we could use that. Yeah, I learned something. We need the heart, yeah. Any clut orgies? Nah, no orgy. An orgy would be kind of a... I mean, they've got everything else. I don't know why they wouldn't have an orgy in the game, right? Kids cult game. Well, we lit... Wow, I have one heart. <laughs> Thanks, game. <laughs> Acquired a crystal window. Cool. Would have been zero. And we got another half heart. Divine blizzard or divine blasts. Knocks enemies back. Knocks enemies back and freezes them. Well, I don't. Let's try this one. We're going to go with this one. What was the other way? A day with no one imprisoned. heart lost the heart who needs a prison when you have a bloody pit definitely feel like the difficulty has risen in this area for sure i'm all for it though yeah Did you guys see the fan made highlight video on discord i did see that yeah that was a load in discord right yeah i'm all for the difficulty I'm glad I'm glad it got harder. Interesting. Can you get a ba? have Zoidberg hands? Oh, you mean the claws we're using? <laughs> well, I guess they kind of are, right? Yeah. 
So this guy is healing the enemy, I just realized. Big meaty claws. Yeah, I, I think this game, as I said earlier, this game is fantastic. I think this is immediately like a uh, game of the year contender. Super good. Had a great time with it. It's probably my favorite roguelite I've played since, uh, probably my favorite roguelite I've played since uh, Hades. Favorite roguelite since Hades. Enter the Gungeon, Hades, this game. I really like this game, super fun. I don't remember other roguelites like Dead Cells is okay. Um, there was that Chinese. What was that Chinese game? I can't remember. Warm Snow was kind of cool. Uh, Ro oh yeah, Rogue Legacy. I would say this is about on par with Rogue Legacy for me. Yeah, about on par with that. Uh, Sifu and Returnal aren't really roguelites, honestly. They're kind of their own thing. They're great games, but yeah, they're not really roguelites. Well, I love FPL, yeah. If I had to choose, it would be a hard choice between this and FTL for me. Probably FTL, but it's by a small margin. It's because FTL is more unique or something, I guess, but this game is very fun. Did you ever play Rogue Legacy 1? No, I never did. Balls above. Balls everywhere. bitch <laughs> fucking god damn it one heart god that game took away so many hearts from me before i got in there what a bunch of bullshit it took away all my fucking hearts too it was like uh no heart uh also you lost another heart and also you lost another heart again a bunch of bullshit uh let's see what do we got here lumber yard two Refinery. We just built refinery too. You know, we haven't tried the demonic summoning circle. We haven't tried this. Possess the follower of the spirit. We should really try the demonic, the the summoning circle. We haven't tried that, right? I kind of want to see what that is. Oh, let's get this one. What is this? Light the cleansing fire and harvest more devotion. Uh, ritual. Uh, you know what? Let's grab this. Let's grab that. Ritual cooldowns down by 50%. That's going to be nice. Hey. God, go rest. Actually, can I, like, heal you or something? Who are you? Let me heal somebody. This guy's, like, almost dead. Who is it that's so. almost dead? Jerome? Jerome's almost dead. Jerome, I will be healed, my child. Stop being sick. Uh, Overdrive, thank you for the resub. Thank you, Overdrive. Do I like this more than Darkest Dungeon 1? Darkest Dungeon 1 is one of my all-time favorite games, man. That's a tough... I just healed you! I just healed him! You are a piece of shit. I just healed you. What was the fucking point of that? Uh, Darkest Dungeon is one of my all-time favorite games, dude. Darkest Dungeon 1. Literally one of my all-time favorite games. Hard to compete with that. If you if you have to judge every game by your all-time favorite. Leader, I returned safely and I brought an offering. I managed to find 34 wood. Thanks, man. All right. Uh, go to bed. Go to sleep. 